Hello my loves, it's Tuesday, the first night of a brand new Meals Vlog and I know that of course because, as always, we've just uploaded one this evening and I'll link it up there in case you fancy going back having a look. So, Heron have had a lot of this planted stuff in recently. Uh, you've seen us have the spinach and avocado burgers, you've seen us have the uh, no chicken goujons in uh, in the boxes of them you get six in these the boxes of fish free goujons which are now in our heron for 69p you get four so i've done jason and i four each with some oven chips our classic mushy pea and frozen pea mix and a bit of leftover guacamole <laughs> nice nice i've got a muffin each and a slice of bread each and i've whisked up a bit of a tartar sauce with um Mayo, lemon juice, chopped gherkins and chopped caper berries in there. So it is actually nice and thick with chopped bits. You know, oh, I do love a tartar style sauce. Fantastic. Uh, should we have a little bite of these? Yeah, we'll, so we'll, bite. we'll just have a little bite of like one of the ends. It's fair to say that they smell a little fishy. I was just slightly. Like, Mm. But the texture's quite firm. It's more chicken. Yeah. Lovely um, crispy coating. Mm -hmm. Tasty crispy coating. Mm -hmm. And the inside's quite, in fact, the inside might be the fishiest of fishless things I've ever had. For me, and I think we've said this before, it's not off putting. No, it's no, no. Not to the point of like, oh no, that's too much. No, no, no. Yeah, I, for me, I don't. I don't think they taste particularly fishy. Sixty-nine p a box, though, along with uh, the veggie um, egg-free omelets, uh, same company. They're in there at the moment as well. Mm. So there you go, loves. There's a nice wide shot of our dinner and the box for Tuesday night. Going down those necks. We're already starving, and we need to watch an episode of uh, Strange New Worlds because we didn't watch Star Trek last night. We both felt weird. Wrong to me. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, loves. Hello, my darlings, and welcome to Wednesday night. Wednesday night, only the second night of the Mills vlog. Can you believe it? Can you really? I can. <laughs> no, not really. Uh, we're just having a veg fest tonight. We do this now and again. Because, um, you know, I had some veg that was, like, going, but I hadn't gone. You know what I mean, don't you? So we've got julienne carrots, shredded white cabbage, mashed potato, cauliflower and peas, and a gravy made with a red pepper, a white onion, and a couple of finger chilies. It's, it's, it's literally a veg fest with some bread and butter, because it would be rude not to. It is actually one of our... We always love this meal whenever we have it, don't we? Yeah, without doubt, without doubt. And it's championing veg, and it's a reminder, even to ourselves sometimes, how tasty and gorgeous veg is. Simple veg, exactly that. Mash and whatever veg you fancy with the right good gravy. That's part of it, isn't it? A right good gravy. Oh, Bertha, you can't beat oh, it. I should, I should say, because it, it would just be rude not to, uh, we're both absolutely living for the new uh, Kylie single. Yeah. You've not heard it. Pardon. But I'm here when I go, but I'm... I won't sing anymore. No. <laughs> I'll leave it there. It's a gorgeous shot. Bye, loves. Hello, my darlings. It's Thursday. That's Thursday. Well, it's part of Thursday night's dinner. But before that, before we talk about this... <gasps> Yay! Yay! It's <laughs> Thursday. That means we're finished work for the weekend. And uh, the only th have-tos this weekend... Well, have-to and want-to. Taking mum for a second radiotherapy session tomorrow, Friday. Uh -huh. And uh, going down to the allotment at some point over this weekend. Yes. Probably a couple of days. Yes. So, what are we having for dinner? Well, we're having an, uh, a Sainsbury's um, no chicken Kiev and two garden gourmet chicken dippers. Nice. Chickenless dippers and a beautiful salad. Mixed leaves, spinach, red onion, tomatoes, 
uh, and avocado. We've had the Sainsbury's Kievs before, haven't we? I think so. I'm pretty sure we have. I mean, I'll tell you what, I'll do, I'll do this anyway because sometimes I have to remember there might be somebody watching the vlog that's not seen. Oh, not seen it before. Oh, did all the juice spill out? Oh, you're losing all your juices, mister. There we go. Oh, it's fair juicy. Fair juicy. juicy. Oh, she is juicy. She's a look. She's a juicy lady. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. So, uh, yes, and for those of you new to the channel, this is a, a, a salad uh, before it, it, I see, I always say that looks perfect for Instagram, doesn't it? It, it just does, I admit it. Right, but you don't eat it like that, do you? You do. You make it look shit <laughs> by doing the shitting. Are we ready, everyone? Are we ready? It's the shitting of the salad. It's shitting. Oh. Shitted. Lovely. So there's it. See? Doesn't look so good for Instagram now. <laughs> it tastes much better because it's all mixed in properly with a lovely dressing. Uh, the dressing is just... Um, extra virgin olive oil and balsamic it's a summer classic for us uh, i tend to go for kind of creamier um i suppose you'd say warmer tasting salad dressings over winter and um a light french style dressing but it's it's often oil and balsamic in summer isn't it i don't know why Off. I've, yes. I, i'm acknowledging that now yeah as we speak i think it's just it's a nice light refreshing Dressing, isn't it? Yeah. And can I just tell you all that all day I've been utterly obsessed with a Padam, a Padam, the new Kylie Minogue song. Thanks from, for that, Stu. From her upcoming album, which the vegan queens are now adding to their set. Just thought I'd let you know that. Be rude not look, it, look it up, look it up. Padam, Padam. Padam, Padam. Yeah. You'll get it. <laughs> Kiev. Dippers, salad, bread. Thursday night at DVG's house. Welcome. Tra! <laughs> <laughs> Bye, loves. Hello, my darlings. It's Friday evening. We've had quite quite the busy day today. Jason's done all the garden. Took mum to a second radiotherapy treatment. That was fine. Went shopping, been to the allotment. Smashed out a load of washing. Do, do, caught up on the laundry completely. So I said to Jay, yeah, right, fancy a Friday sandwich. Really being Friday, you know. Um, those of you that know us know that our, what we call a Friday sandwich, it's always in this order. English mustard, vegan cheese, sausage or bacon, ketchup on the bottom slice, on the top slice, mayo, and a beautiful mixed salad to go with it all. Quick shitting? Uh, yeah, well, I, hang on, I was just going to say, so we've got English mustard, Cathedral City cheese, mm. La Vie bacon, um, Hellman's ketchup, randomly, uh, Hellman's vegan mayo, and um, Sainsbury's olive oil ciabatta, mm. clearly marked vegan. Shall we do the shitting, Jason? A quick one, a quick one. Let's let's shit it, shall it's we? It's the <laughs> shitting of the salad. It's shitted, 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 shitted. Marvellous. There we go. Um, do you want to do your own after? Uh, yeah, you yeah. do you. It's quite specific, isn't it? You do you, Barbara. I think what I'm going to do this time, to be honest, and I mentioned this earlier, I think I'm going to load myself up yeah. with a, an adequate amount, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to cut this in half. Yeah, good good, good call. Yeah, definitely. <sighs> it will be a lot easier to eat. But that... Like that. It's going to be... There you go. Fantastic. An epic Friday sandwich. Just there. Oh, I forgot the pimento olives in the... Uh, Salad as well, I'll remember because one dropped off then. There we go. There we go. So there we go. Before salad, after salad, salad for Paul. <laughs> Friday sandwiches is. Bye, loves. Hello, loves. It's Saturday night and we're about to go live for our mukbang, which happens to be a one planet pizza sourdough pepperoni mukbang. And there they are, two pizzas on the chopping board sent to us from One Planet Pizza. I've whipped up a potato salad with some Anya potatoes from Sainsbury's. Nuked them bits, cut them up, nuked them for five minutes, let them go cool. Added mayo, a little bit of vinegar and some chives. 
uh, made a coleslaw with shredded white cabbage, julienne carrot and shredded white onion, mayo and a bit of English mustard. We've got a bit of a side salad. Yeah. Mukbang night. I hope you joined us. If you didn't, look what you missed. Bye loves. Hello my loves, it's Sunday evening and if you saw our mukbang last night, well, if you, you know, I showed you the bits we were having. We're finishing off the potato salad and the coleslaw that I made for it. Uh, I've done a spicy couscous, a little mixed salad with some Caesar dressing and the ultimate cheeseburger. It's uh, English mustard on the bottom uh, with mixed salad and sliced tomato and then a Linda McCartney quarter pounder with Cathedral City cheese, fried onions, ketchup, mayo, you know, the whole kit and caboodle. So it's kind of summery, kind of sorta. Yeah, yeah, you know. it looks delightful. It looks absolutely delightful. I'm thoroughly looking forward to tucking into it. Bit of graft at the allotment today. Yes. Thunderstorm. The temperature's dropped a little bit, which is nice. Oh, it's lovely. Uh, we've had showers, done our exercises. And it's been a productive weekend, hasn't it? It really has. And now we're going to stuff this right down the sauce because we're bloody starving. It's been one of those days. We've burned a lot of energy today. Mm. Time to get some back. Bye, loves. It's Jason's Lunchtime Taste Tests. Hello you lovely person you and this is what I have for my lunch today and uh, I'm quite excited not gonna lie so um, those of you who are not in the know although I'm sure some of you are this is the new Beyond Meals range uh, this is one of three I believe I have two of them so you know what's coming next week um, this is the spaghetti bolognese at three pounds from Tesco 17 grams of protein per meal seven minutes in the microwave and of course clearly marked vegan I'll just show you the uh, the back so you can see everything that you need to see in terms of the nutritional information and the cooking and the ingredients. Cooked spaghetti in a tomato and herb sauce with plant-based mints. So I'm naturally going to compare this to the Bisto uh, spaghetti bolognese that I had ages ago, uh, which sadly seems to have disappeared off the shelves um, locally to us. I don't know about yourselves, but I did really enjoy the uh, the Bisto spaghetti bolognese, so I'm hoping that this is going to be awesome. I'm expecting great things, so I'll nuke it, and as always, give you my honest opinion. Okay, here it is, all cooked and sorted. I don't know if you can see that there, but it's uh, smells all right. Not smelling of anything like oh, that smells gorgeous. Not that kind of thing, but it smells all right. Do you know what I mean? Um, so let's just dive in and give it a try. Uh, I've tried to allow. It, the allotted time to cool down a little bit. Mm. And thankfully it's not scalding my mouth off so I can actually taste it properly. First mouthful, uh, it's proper tasty, not gonna lie. Mm. Also, the spaghetti is really good considering it's from Frozen. Similar to my memory, uh, similar to the Bisto uh, Frozen ready meal. Similar, uh, ilk. Mmm. Got some bits of carrot in there. Quite nice, very flavoursome. Nice, uh, nice texture on the spaghetti, like I said. The sauce is lovely. No complaints. It's pretty decent. I'm gonna have one more mouthful. Mmm, mmm. Three pound. I know some of the Beyond stuff, and I think we've said it in shopping vlogs before. A little bit on the high end, price wise, but three pound at Tesco's, this is great. Um, what am I gonna give it? It's gonna get a solid eight out of 10, because it's pretty tasty, it's pretty quick to cook, and it's quite reasonably priced. So, solid eight out of 10, and you're also getting 17 grams of protein per meal, which is excellent. Uh, because as, of course, every nutritionalist in the world, that is all humans who are not vegan, are qualified nutritionists, um, 
we're all desperate for protein. None of us as vegans are getting enough protein. So 17 grams in there. Well done, Beyond Meals, eight out of 10. Check them out if you get the chance. Would recommend. And now I'm gonna go and finish the rest of this off. Get on with my working day. It's another scorcher today here in uh, the northwest of England. But uh, I hope you are doing great. And as always, take care of yourself. And I will, of course, see you very soon. Hello, my loves. It's Monday night and the last night of this particular meals vlog. And this is a late dinner for us. It's a ten past nine because we've been to uh, an allotment committee meeting tonight. So I said to Jay, I said, I'll do a tuna pasta. You might remember a long while ago we went to Sainsbury's. It was in one of our shopping vlogs and they had tins of their own um, non-tuna for 15p. And I got a few because they were dated 2024. So there's two tins of uh, vegan tuna and mayo in this. Wholemeal pasta, sweet corn, uh, spring onions. Um, I dressed it with a bit of mayo, a bit of that pesto dressing from... Asda. Oh yeah. And I grated some Cathedral City on it as well. It's a nice little uh, concoction, isn't it? And we've got a 36p garlic bread from Tesco. I think it's still 36p. It's probably gone up there. It's around that kind of price though. Do I have it? a taste, promise? Yeah. Cheap as chips meal, really, isn't it? Very cheap. Very cheap meal, yeah. It might need some salt and black pepper, which is why they're there. Mmm. But it might just be already full of flavour. Yeah. Pretty damn good. Yeah. I think it's got plenty of flavour. For me, personal taste, it's a little crack of black pepper. Yeah. But it's great. That's common though with pasta, is it? You must have black pepper. It's great pasta. as it is, to be fair. It's flavoursome. The pasta's cooked perfectly just how we like it. Yeah. There we Bottom. go. So it's wholemeal penne. Uh, kind of, sort of, tuna, sort of, pasta. <laughs> kind of, sort of. But vegan, of course. See you on the next one. Bye, loves. <laughs>